Good evening. The suspect in a deadly hit and run crash overnight has now been identified. 33 year old Santos Montiel called authorities who came and took him into custody at a gas station on Normandy Boulevard today. Now, the crash happened just after midnight last night at Normandy and Stratton Road. 37 year old Michael Moon was killed and SUV rear ended his scooter. And hit and runs are a growing problem in Florida. In fact, Jacksonville ranks third in the whole state for the most hit and runs. The number of victims is staggering. Our Laura Queso has the special report. These are the many faces of hit and runs on the first coast. Some no longer with us. 18 year old Shane Savoy hit by a truck while walking to school. There are heroes. 16 year old Kayla Johnson. Thank you, Kayla. You saved my life. Kayla pushed these twins out of the way of a truck while waiting for the school bus. There are those who are still living with the pain of loss. Orly Ohian was hit and her mother killed after walking to Yom Kippur service. And some are living with the physical pain of not knowing who did this. As far as walking, yeah, I should be running, probably not. It was right here on Southside Boulevard where 28-year-old Albert Eyes was helping two women change their flat tire. It was 3 o'clock in the morning. He says that's when his world went completely black. I heard the tire squeal and then went to look up, and that was when I woke up in the median. Then the sound of sirens. Now five months later, no one is in custody for Albert's injury, an injury that cost him his hopes for a pro basketball career. Florida Highway Patrol Sergeant Dylan Bryan says the number of hit and runs is rising. So what, what it looks like is people are becoming impatient and just deciding to leave. Since January 1, 4,879 hit and runs have been reported with 700 injuries and 11 deaths. That's on pace to beat last year's 8,791 hit and runs reported. Areas where more than 40% happen, Atlantic Boulevard, Southside Boulevard, and Beach Boulevard. Typically what we've seen is not necessarily the criminal element, the ones that are wanted or suspended driver's license that are causing these hit and run crashes and leaving. It's, uh, it's the average citizen that are, you know, um, going from point A to point B. In Florida, leaving the scene of an accident involving property damage could mean 60 days in jail. Leaving an accident that results in death 30 years behind bars. Amanda Venson saw this firsthand. I was just driving down Beach Boulevard, and I looked up ahead, and I saw a white SUV move across several lanes of traffic, run up onto the curb, and hit a construction worker that was working on a sign. I saw him fly through the air and land on the pavement uh, several feet away. Venson stopped and started CPR. So when he came to, he, uh, said he can't breathe I can't breathe I can't breathe and I said well if you're if you're talking you're breathing he said well don't let me die don't let me die but leaving the scene is getting tougher in Duval County why these cameras and while our cameras were rolling these two men cross busy Southside Boulevard Florida Department of Transportation is serious about traffic safety and pedestrian safety. FDOT planted this pedestrian crosswalk on San Jose and Haley Road after Orley's accident. And as the public gets concerned about certain areas we will contact our engineers, we will contact our traffic operations folks, our maintenance folks to look at the timing of the lights. But Tittle couldn't tell us if FDOT is looking into making changes in the worst areas, Southside Atlantic and Beach Boulevard. A lot of times, if you look at the crash data, a lot of times there, there's alcohol involved. We can do as much as we can for the design and emphasis, but it has to come down to individual responsibility. For Ives, this info doesn't cut it. There were no cameras installed when he was hit back in June. Somebody out there knows this guy that hit me, and he knows he hit me, and he left me to die. Laura Queso, First Coast News, NBC 12, ABC 25.